Brooks is an award-winning actor and star of acclaimed shows like Six Feet Under and Parenthood. Yes. In his latest role, he's putting out fires at work and at home, playing Captain Bobby Nash on 911. Take a look. Looks like it was the circuit board on the street lamp. One of the relays was fried. You did everything right. And she's still dead. But not because of you. I know it doesn't feel that way that you feel responsible. Bobby, I'm the one that drove into her. I mean, you, you can show me a million pieces of paper that, that, that says it's not my fault, but it's still gonna feel like it is. Did you know she played the cello? It was an accident, Hen. You've been cleared by the department. You can return to duty whenever you want. Please welcome the very talented Peter Krause. Marie, congratulations on uh, your long run in Las Vegas. Oh, I just wanted to let you know the very first concert I ever saw was at the Minnesota State Fairgrounds back in the early 70s. My dad took my sister and I to see the Osmonds. Oh, wow. Wow, I remember that yeah. fair. Yeah. Wow. And we used your husband's song Crazy Train last year in a yep. big montage where Bobby yeah. moves from Minnesota to L.A. Nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Right and we love your show. Oh, yeah. thank you. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Um, I want to say congratulations on the third season Woo! of 911. Thank now, you. this show started with a huge tsunami yes. in Los Angeles. Wow. Yeah. Yes, now, that must have been so interesting to yeah. shoot. Uh, it was. We filmed down in Mexico for a week in Rosarita at the Baja Studios. Fantastic crew down there. And it's, uh, it was built for uh, the oh, wow. Titanic. And wow. our lead construction uh, guy, Tony, wow. built half of the merry-go-round that yeah. you normally see down on the Santa Monica yes. Pier. Mm -hmm. And they built that there. We, uh, we were down there for Ooh. a week shooting in the water. And I had to don the scuba gear and go underwater. It was a good Ooh. time. Oh, wow. That looked wow. amazing. Yeah. It looked so scary. Scary. Yeah. Yeah. It was, it was scary. a really good time. It's a, it's a big show. Wow. wow. Now, this wow. season, wow. UFC and WWE champion Ronda Rousey joined the cast, who I love. Yeah. Um, she's amazing. Now, as a professional fighter, she's used to kind of getting hurt. It's kind of like what happens on yeah. uh, every day, you know, for her. But something unexpected happened on set. And before you explain what happened yep. to her, anyone who is squeamish, please look away. Uh -oh. uh, so it was Ronda's first take and her first scene. And she has to come charging out of uh, below deck on a yacht. Mm -hmm. And she lifted up the hatch. And as she came out, she rest her hand. And then the hatch came right down on her oh, hand. Oh. She pulled her hand out of there, went on with the scene. Oh, oh. She finished. She finished. <laughs> yeah, she finished. She finished the scene. Afterwards, she, she said, finished? she said, I think I hurt my finger. Wow. Yeah. But that's wow. why she's, she's great. Said she's so hardcore. Wow. Yeah, she's cool. Wow. That's she's incredible. Incredible. Okay. I like her. But you wow. also had a little accident on your very first day of shooting oh, that boy. left your co-stars in stitches. Yeah. Tell everyone what you did. <laughs> well, I was real amped up about getting to this kid who had been drowning in this pool, and we rehearsed it, and then I thought, all right, I'm just going to go get that kid. Mm -hmm. And we're in this kind of glass-walled house, and I forgot where the door was, and I just walked straight into a window. No! Oh, no. Wait, oh, actually, actually, we have some footage of it. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Aisha, you'll see, eventually winds She's up on the dying. floor in there. Oh, yeah. my gosh. They all had a really good, good laugh. <laughs> hey, how was yeah. that? Uh, yeah. It's so I good. It's a sport. It's a sport. Have you had any other mishaps on sets and things? Well, there have been a couple times where I have to squat down in order to pick up a bodyboard to lift mm -hmm. up mm -hmm. a you know, uh, accident victim, mm -hmm. and my pants have split. Oh, wow. <laughs> and we have tape of that. Oh, no, no please don't. don't. <laughs> and uh, there, there is another member of our cast who split their pants while twerking, but I won't say who that was. Oh, oh. I want to know. No, 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 I can't say. <laughs> okay, all right. You know, <laughs> you know what I want to know is that, okay, so the emergencies that are on 911 yes. are based 
on real life 911 calls. Many of them are, yeah. And so what is the most unusual one that it's a real one that you've heard? Boy, we've had a lot of unusual ones starting with that snake the first season, but mm -hmm. I think the the stupidest one that I saw was there are some kids who did a YouTube prank or something mm -hmm. where they cemented one of their friends' heads in a microwave. Oh, my what? God. And so we, we did that last season. We used that for a storyline last season, but the firefighters were very angry at these kids. Like, we could have a real call, and yeah. you guys are yeah. cementing your head in a microwave. That's crazy. It wow. is crazy. Oh, What's wrong with Very scary. Yeah. What, is what is wrong, wrong with people? people? What is wrong with people? Wrong with people? <laughs> Good luck. Yeah. Yeah. like yeah. that. Yeah. So, um, Angela Bassett plays your wife, yeah. 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 What has it been like to work with her? She is fantastic. Oh. Um, one of the first days that uh, we were at work, our first season, she was upstairs in our firehouse playing foosball with everybody. And she's incredibly playful, always prepared, and uh, I love having her as my TV wife and my scene partner. She's oh, fantastic. That's so, cool. Cool. so wait, I have another question. Uh -oh. You also have real life responders who work as consultants on the show. We do. So what kind of stories do they tell you? Well, a lot of incredible stories, but Chief Mike Bowman, Commander Bowman, um, is our firefighter correspondent, mm -hmm. uh, uh, consultant. Mm -hmm. And he told us a story about them saving a high rise in downtown Los Angeles years ago and how they have to improvise frequently to figure out how to handle things. Mm -hmm. The elevators were shut down. They had to carry all the hoses up the stairs and they were getting dehydrated. So they had firefighters go out and find uh, water canisters from office buildings, you know, water coolers yeah, to bring, right. oh, and they yeah. were they were drinking yeah. out of water coolers to try and stay hydrated and not have to keep going up and down mm -hmm. the stairs. So just little things like that. Yeah. But, yeah. Wow, yeah. that's fascinating. Yeah. You wouldn't even think of that. Thank them all for their service and all that they do for us. Well, Peter Krause, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you, pleasure. Nine one one airs Monday nights.